So Antonin Scalia passed away recently and so a lot of rich people were upset because he was an enormous defender of the rich and the powerful. So um, George Mason University, which is known to be conservative, uh, apparently called up a couple of donors and boom, jackpot. So let me read from Law News for you guys. Last week, the Board of Visitors at George Mason University, it's always a funny name, it sounds like they just drop by for a visit. We're part of the Board of Visitors, we won't be staying long. Anyway, uh, approved renaming the law school in honor of the late Justice Antonin Scalia after an anonymous donor provided a $20 million gift to the law school to facilitate the name change. Yeah, they're, of course, they're always anonymous. Now, if you're proud of Antonin Scalia, why not put your name on it? They're like, hey, way to look out for us, man. I saved a lot of taxes because of you. Way to go, Antonin, my boy. No, 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 don't tell them who I am. Okay. So uh, let's assume that they were just trying to be generous and didn't want other people to know how generous they are, right? Okay, great. Well, as of last Thursday, uh, as Law News explains, the name was officially changed uh, to, well, make sense, the Antonin Scalia School of Law at George Mason University. Wait a minute. Let's spell that out. Antonin Scalia, well, that's A-S, right? That's good, okay. Uh, school, Antonin Scalia School, uh-oh. Of law, O L. Oh no, <laughs> that spells asshole. <laughs> oh, twenty million dollars well spent. Thank you, anonymous donor. The most accurately named law school in the country. <laughs> well done, well done. Okay, God, they're so smart, the conservatives. Except they didn't bother spelling it out. <laughs> okay, now in a panic, they named it, they changed it, it was official, and then all the students are like, dude, now I'm going to asshole university, don't do this to me, right? They're like, oh no, what have we done? So they changed it to Antonin Scalia Law School. <laughs> okay, by the way, final twist of this story, that's where I used to broadcast my first Young Turk shows all the way back in the day. So if you saw Matt as hell, the movie about uh, the Young Turks and the whole thing, you'll see the public access shows that I do. It was out of George Mason, that same building, before it became an asshole building. <laughs> oh, those were the good old days. Actually, back then I was a Republican, so perhaps I belonged in that building. <laughs>